Hi everybody, it's Haley. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. Um, I am an independent Scentsy consultant and I like to review candles and wax and all that good stuff. Um, Happy New Year's Eve. <laughs> Today I have for you my empties from December. Um, it's quite a bit of stuff, so <laughs> I'll try to go through it quickly. Um, I've got Bath and Body Works and Scentsy stuff in here. Okay, so I think I'm going to start with the Bath and Body Works stuff and then I'll go into this, to the Scentsy stuff. Um, I got through quite a few candles as well as wax because that's my goal. Um, so the first candle from Bath and Body Works I got through the beginning of December was Tis the Season. This packaging was in the special Santa box last year and I just had some left of this candle so I finished it up. Um, Tis the season is rich red apple, sweet cinnamon, and cedar wood. It's really pretty. I think they have this one every year, but that one was special packaging because it came in that Santa box. Um, I did finish a The Perfect Christmas um, from this year's packaging. This one is one of my favorites. This one is fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, and toasted marshmallow. I love this candle. <laughs> Um, this packaging was really pretty, but last year's packaging, <laughs> I've said this before, was so cute. And I actually keep, I'm keeping that candle because it's adorable. It's got Santa in his sleigh on it. So, not burning that. I got this one last year at Sass. This is Apple Garland. Um, I think this one's, is this one out again? I don't know. It might be. Apple Garland is... It says made with eucalyptus and cedar with essential oils with notes of gala apples and mistletoe. It's pretty. I used it up. I hadn't even started burning that one last year, so. So many candles, you guys. It's a candle, candle crazy woman. I melted, melted. <laughs> I burned Mary Cookie. This is my first Mary Cookie. So Mary Cookie was fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. Um, I thought I was going to really like this one, and it turns out I'm just meh about it. I know it's a super popular scent from Bath & Body Works, and I was kind of just like, meh, that's okay. My next one, I told you I burned a lot. I grabbed Holiday Cheers. Um, so Holiday Cheers was warm vanilla, spiced rum, and a dash of nutmeg. I feel like this one burned really quickly. It was really pretty, and it burned really fast. I don't know if this is still available. I think it is on the website. One of the websites. This one's from last year as well. Butter rum eggnog. This was last year's packaging. Um, spiced eggnog, vanilla bourbon, rich buttercream, shaved nutmeg. This one was really nice too. So I don't think I had started, oh, I might have started burning that one last year and finished it up this year. Right at the beginning of December, I did a Kringle candle, Donut Worry, and it burned quite well. There's a little bit of soot. This one threw, threw really well. Um, it's just cute and adorable. I have a couple Kringle candles and I did get through that one. Let's see here. Oh yes, I talked about this in my last video. Cookies for Santa. Cookies with Santa. <laughs> this one is fresh cinnamon, brown sugar, and drop of vanilla. This is the one I had burning like Christmas Eve, Christmas Day. The packaging was super cute. And the, the scent was really nice too. So that's seven candles. Go me. <laughs> I got through in December. Um, let's see. I, we all, we, I shouldn't say I, we also got through, this is last year's part packaging again, fresh sparkling snow, super cute packaging. Um, the scent notes are on here. Where are they? Oh no, they're not. Just says fresh sparkling snow on the back. So I got through that one. And we also got through on the nice list. This was this year's packaging, which is fresh mint apple. So crisp red apple, white eucalyptus, and winter lemon. That one was really nice. Um, any more Bath and Body Works in here? Yep. 
my daughter loved this and I love it too the pumpkin cupcake body wash um, whipped buttercream pumpkin spice and vanilla cake batter one of my favorite body washes from Bath and Body Works and I've got one more one more random thing before a scentsy um, I've talked about Twisted Allure before so this was called Live Die Haunt and it was Creepy Cotton Candy Creepy Cotton Candy Body Wash and my kids really like that too so we finished that up okay getting into the scentsy so I did use up um, a Perfect Peppermint dish soap I've said this before I love the dish soap at first I wasn't a big fan, but as I've used it, I found that I love it. <clears throat> um, I did use up, I have blueberry cheesecake. These were in the clearance section. I have these down here in my basement in the laundry room going right now. They're super strong. And I had, let's see, a vanilla bourbon and a vanilla mint. I had those two together before I put in the blueberry cheesecake. So I used those up. Now let's get into wax. What did I melt? You guys will be proud of me. <laughs> so I think I've, I've melted so many of these bars. Um, Olaf Warm Hugs. Olaf Warm Hugs is lovely. It's like a vanilla, beautiful, light vanilla, kind of minty scent. I think I still have like five bars. I think it's in my club. I just really like it. Um, I did finish up a Christmas cottage. It's pretty strong. Kind of smells like cinnamon hearts. Not my favorite, but it was okay. Um, what else here? Pretty and plaid. Pretty and plaid. I got this. <laughs> I got this during the clearance. I think it's still in the clearance section. If you go to my website, um, it's very strong. So if you like strong scents, you'll like it. It's not that I dislike the scent, it's that it is too strong for me. It's just, I am a little bit sensitive to super strong scents, so if you don't like strong scents, I do not recommend Pretty and Plaid. Um, I did finish up the Season of Magic, the Disney one. Um, I loved this one. It's like berry and pine. My husband hated this one. <laughs> Anytime I had it melting, he was like, turn that off, it's giving me a headache. But I really liked it. But I only did get one bar. No, that's my second bar, I think. Because I don't want to give my husband a headache. I finished an almond. Almond croissant. My dog always has to get into stuff. Almond croissant is lovely. It's very pastry-ish. I did finish an icicles and evergreen. This was a scent of the month in November. It's a nice pine scent. But it's got that icicle element to it. I finished an app or orchard apples and spice which came out in the fall beautiful spicy fall scent. I did finish a sugared strawberry. My daughter loves this scent. Very sweet, very strawberry. Very vibrant. Polar bear hug. Okay. Wanted to talk about polar bear hug. <laughs> um I like the scent. Again, it's very nice, but again, um, it's too strong for me. We live in quite a small house. I don't know if that's why I feel like it's too strong. I had it going on my desk right where I was working on my computer and it was just, it wasn't doing it for me. Um, I think this one used to be called Eskimo Kiss and they changed the name to be a little bit more sensitive, um, which is good. I, I have mixed feelings about Polar Bear Hug. Oh, my doggy. Bonfire Beach. Love Bonfire Beach. You guys know this. Beautiful. And I know it's kind of a summery scent, but I had a bar and I'm like, I'm going to finish that. I was in a Bonfire Beach mood. Spiced Apple Chestnut. This came out this winter in the Scent of the Seasons collection. Really pretty. Really pretty scent. Enjoyed that a lot. And... You guys, I went through so much. Autumn Road Trip. Autumn Road Trip came out this fall as well. Really pretty autumn scent. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve bars. 
are you proud of me or what? That's a lot of bars for me to use. <laughs> so it went through seven candles and 12 bars. So I'm hoping I was home a lot in December. I think that's why I was using so much because when I am back at work, I go back to work on Tuesday. Um, I won't be home as much. So I don't tend to leave my warmers going when I'm not home. So <laughs> we'll see. I usually light my candle as soon as I get home um, and turn on a couple of my warmers. So I just need to be really good about changing the scents up. Um, and hopefully I will have just as many scents used up. <laughs> um, I did my makeup kind of crazy today. It is New Year's Eve, but um, just for fun. We're not really doing anything, just hanging out at home. But thought it would be fun. I hope you guys all have a wonderful night and that you're super safe. And I wish you a very happy new year. Um, and hopefully I can put out a couple more videos very soon. I'm not sure when, but hopefully soon. And thank you guys again so much for watching. I am going to put my link to my Scentsy website down below. There's still some awesome stuff in the clearance section. Um, also, lots of stuff is going away um, January 1st, so that's tomorrow. So I should have put this video up before, but like the up warmer is not going to be available anymore. It's going in the vault. Um, there's a list of things that are going in the vault. So if you were eyeing something and you're like not sure if it's going to go away, you can message me and I'll let you know um, so you can grab it. Anyways, guys, thank you so much. I'll see you in the new year. Bye.